All right, here we are with Mr. Michael Blair. This is his video evaluation for his VCR IMG bot here. All right, Michael, very good technique. I like the steadiness on the on the head, being very very balanced. Compact swing, keeping it short. Careful, the strings are a little close. Okay, we like to see a little bit of an angle open, so you hit a little cleaner at contact. Good extension, excellent follow through. You're transferring forward pretty much. There's not much to say here technically. Okay, they're doing a good job back at home teaching you technique. Other than just a little bit close, but very good. Um, I know you're a big fan of Roger, so let's put some Roger here next to you. One of my favorite clips from Roger. Take a look at how his strings are not completely close facing to the ground. They're always more likely facing to the camera, right? So by the time he makes contact, you see there's a little bit of an angle right there. So by the time he makes contact, he hits very clean. There's no need to adjust the head of the racket. The less movement you have to do with the head of the racket, the better. The more efficient, right? See from a different angle. He closes it sometimes. See this one. Uh, the one hander. Uh, this is forehand. forehand. Here on the open stance, you see the strings are a little bit more open. Not so close. Right there. That's something I would like to see working on. That's very being very picky because technically it's very solid. All right, the one-hander. I like your one-hander. You're doing a good job. Early preparation. You get behind with that outside leg, then you step in. I like the release, and I really like that you're keeping that shoulder high with that ball cap pointing to the ground. That's good finish right there. Uh, let me put Roger here again. This is a little bit of a lower ball, but the fundamentals are the same. Good hip and shoulder rotation, staying underneath the ball, and look at the finish. All right? Very similar. All right, so I would like to see you keep working on it. Very good. Next, on your serve. Oh, that's not your serve. Good looking motion also. Um, a little too much sideways I feel. Okay, maybe you can open up a little bit more to the court because I see here on unwinding you having to spend a lot of your energy to rotate to start facing the court again. And that causes you to miss some of your timing. Your timing is a little bit off. You see that you're hitting down on the ball. I want to see you hitting up on it. This is Roger again. See a good trophy position. He's not so close, right? So it allows him to have a little bit better rotation going into the court. He makes the contact on the way up, goes up a little bit more, and then starts going down. One of the tricks on the serve is you got to heat up. Okay? It's a misconception of hitting down on the serve. But our target is not actually at the service box. Our target is at contact. Okay? So chest, chin, everything needs to be pointing up. Understood? Any questions, Mr. Blair? No questions. All right. Remember, my name is Juan Herrera. My email address. If you have any questions of your own, glad to have you here at the academy. Hopefully, we'll get to see you back in a short time. Where's a full-time student? Take care.